why can't I get pregnant? How do we get through this? My body is cleansing itself. I feel so detoxy. I just want ease. I just need peace. Guys, are you listening? What am I doing wrong? I feel so defeated. I feel so defeated. with you, sweet child. Please know that as you navigate these times, these end times, if you will, that we are with you. We know those words only mean so much in your realm. But we are going to again remind you that when you come into this place here with us, you do feel the truth of our presence. You do feel the truth of our comfort. This is why the light workers are so brave in our eyes. It is very difficult for the light worker system to open into the heightened sensitivities that are needed for an ascension while living in this dense realm. But know that as you raise your frequency and your senses and abilities are heightening and attuning themselves into this reality that you are creating, the density will continue to pull away. And only in the splitting of these two realities, the dark and the light, are you feeling that splitting within you. The places where you still carry resonances with that density. Because the truth of the matter is, is all of the things that you are focusing on are in complete harmony in these higher realities. And if you yourself were not focusing on the things of lack that are present around you and the things that are not yet manifested, you sure would allow it to come forward at a very accelerated pace. We would like to extend comfort to you during this time as we know the frequencies that you are balancing are not that of just a bad day. And we do want to bring that into the awareness of this conversation. Because there are also people dealing with ailments within their bodies that do too need the adjusting that we speak of and the soothing that we speak of. And these frequencies too are not that of just a bad day. They are of offset systems coming back into harmony. And an offset system coming back into harmony needs much more attention than an offset attitude needing to refocus. While they are one in the same, one is perpetuated and just deeper ingrained into the subconscious mind. Deeper frequency holds on the psyche.
Crystal, you also get yourself torn up because there are pieces of your path that you know that we are not going to disclose to you. Just like when you ask us for the timing of the new earth and we bring you back to the timing of your journey and how committed and dedicated you are to the consistency of that vibration. We love you so much. But the not getting pregnant is a frequency imbalance. And it is getting more difficult as the time goes on because there is more awareness being placed. <sighs> On the fact that it's not happening. And while that stings, you too know it to be true. So during this time, we are going to ask that you remain unattached to the energy and continue to allow it to pass through. This is the most conducive thing you can do to this flow of energy that is coming through you at this time. Allow for the shifts to happen. Manage your energy as needed. You're exactly where you are meant to be on the verge of all of these shifts, on the verge of all of these transitions. And if this is the thing that is keeping your heart out of alignment with your truth and where you need to be, then we would also say that this is not where your focus should be at this time. And while for you that topic is your fertility, for others it could be anything. It could be their relationship, their weight, their cancer. If you are focusing on something that is not working for you at this time, it is best that you find other things to focus on. It is best that you find something easier where your energy fields can be in a state of flow. And as you find yourself regaining your balance, you can always come back into this space. You must only tip the scales. You must only find yourself focusing in a way that is productive energetically more often then you are focusing on what is. And you will have the clarity that you seek. Crystal says all the time, I don't mean, I don't mind being in the ebb. I just don't want to feel bad. And with most topics, you do a very delicious job getting yourself out of the way. But pregnancy is an extension of you feeling like you don't have control over your body. And that is not true. So if you need to take the time to focus on regaining control of your body, then that is what you focus on. The only thing we desire for the collective at this time is to find more spaces of neutrality, 
When you find more spaces of neutrality, you will find yourself tipping the scales. Many light workers like Crystal have a difficult time letting go, surrendering in the places where you are shifting so quickly. And when you shift so quickly, you do feel it so intensely. So over the coming days, as the energy heightens on your planet, we will encourage you to find it easier and easier to release and let go of any ideas or attachments you have in the moments that you are feeling yourself move and allow for the flow of energy that is moving you to feel free and unobscured and see what happens in that space. We will remind you that no decisions are ever to be made when you are in a state of no alignment. When you are in a state of resistance, it is never the time to figure it out as the solution is not within vibrational reach. So surrendering is the flow until you find yourself in proximity of answers, which won't take too long should you let go. We have given you the love that you need today, Crystal. And now that we have spent time in this space together, we are going to ask that you just go play. Allow yourself to relinquish everything that you are releasing today. And it is okay that you feel defeated. It is a lie that you are choosing so that you can move out of this space quickly. And would we ever choose for you to feel defeated to move back into your empowerment? Empowerment? Well, if it is the path that will get you there sooner, we will encourage you to take that. It doesn't matter how you get there. Just let go. There's nothing wrong. You are not broken. And all is well in this world. And it is getting better every day. We love you. And we are with you. But for today, we are complete.